donating blood saves lives. Paul Bertel knows that, but years ago, he was afraid of needles. He actually encouraged other people at his workplace uh, to donate blood at the office blood drive for many years. And somebody called my bluff and they said, so Paul, are you gonna donate tomorrow? And I reluctantly said, yes, I, I will. That was back in the early 90s. And since then, Paul has never looked back. It is so easy. There's a, there's a slight prick, of course, when the, when the needle goes in the arm, but that's, that's not really any worse than maybe getting a flu shot. Paul started donating blood and then platelets. Platelets are like gold for patients facing critical illnesses. And because they have a shelf life of just five days, platelets are always needed. Those platelets are used for uh, specifically cancer patients and some open heart surgeries and that sort of thing. I come twice a month. You can donate platelets up to 24 times a year. Twice a month for more than 25 years adds up. I am just below 49 gallons. It's hard to get somebody to sit still for two hours and be hooked up to a machine and give two hours of themselves to the community with nothing in return. His dedication is really above and beyond because um, a lot of people don't necessarily donate as often as they are able. Each of us can make a difference in our own little way and enough of us making a difference in our little way makes a big difference. It's surprise time for Paul. Check it out. Oh, Seven wow. News and Trusted Choice. That's the Independent Insurance Agents of Colorado. Oh, wow. I want to honor you as a seven everyday hero. I'm not the hero. You are the hero. You are the hero. The hero. <laughs> Congratulations. All I do is lie in a bed and get a needle stuck in me. Well, then give us this back. <laughs>